Hi there, I'm Rob McCoy with Ram Communications, and let's go through quick tip number three for cybersecurity. Be honest with yourself, and if you need to, get some help. Here's why. What we found in the typical business landscape is the following. Most IT pros and their staffs are set up to fail. Many organizations only have one person. They're really lucky if there are two or three people within the same department. If you're in an organization that has more than six internal IT people, congratulations, you're in the upper echelon. But keep this in mind, no matter what your IT headcount is, no one is a security expert in all categories. The problem is this, in technology, you need people with expertise and the right technology to work effectively together. What we're finding is that many, if not most organizations, have a disconnect, and that disconnect is between IT security and risk compliance. Both are fighting for the same resources. IT and executive leadership haven't kept up with the changes in the security landscape, and then the folks that are in compliance want to cover their security needs just to keep the company from being sued. Now, IT security usually doesn't want to admit that they can't keep the business secure. We're keeping the business as secure as we can. So often, the risk compliance and the leadership teams hear a common statement, and they believe we are secure. That's not necessarily true. There are over 3.5 million unfilled security positions in the United States. There's an estimated $6 trillion in losses experts are purporting that will take place over the next year with all the cybercrime. There's a huge transition of workers becoming remote, as we know, because of technology and because of the COVID situation. Phishing attacks are at an all-time high. And then, as I mentioned earlier, you have compliance versus security. Now remember, we are here to help you. The goal is to help your leaders and end users change their way of thinking about cybersecurity. So the big question is, where do you start? Here's our suggestions. The first thing is you need to start with awareness. Everyone in your organization needs to be aware of the risks and the potential damages of cybersecurity. Remember, it only takes one attack to create havoc and bring your organization to a standstill. Educate your entire organization. Again, everybody has to take ownership and address the problem as a team. Test your entire organization on a regular basis. Ask for help from your colleagues and experts like RAM. Audit your current defenses. Keep this in mind. Can you see everyone? Can you see every device and every activity that is occurring on your network? Now, I've listed some educational and testing resources. Several of these, uh, especially the one by the federal government, are free. And I, I have some free content for you as well if you visit our website. So please remember, if you've got questions, concerns, if you're looking for expert resources, we have them. Visit our website anytime. Give us a call and we're happy to help. Have a great day.